I'm Donald, a senior consultant with Full Property here in the UK. I've got a short demo detailing F5's ASM ICAP configuration working with Trend Micro. Configured on our F5, we have a virtual server for our photo upload web page, protected by an ASM policy. We have our Trend Micro ICAP server and we have the upload server web page itself. OK, let's configure the F5. Navigate to Security Options, Application Security, Integrated Services and Antivirus Protection. Enter the ICAP server hostname or IP address. In this case, the default port number is correct. Select Guaranteed Enforcement checkbox to ensure all files are checked. And remember to save the configuration. Next, we'll go to Security, Application Security, Policy Building, Learning and Blocking Settings. Then select the appropriate policy. Click the Advanced tab, expand the antivirus, select the Alarm and Block checkboxes, click Save and apply the policy. Next, we'll set some variables. Navigate to Security, Options, Application Security, Advanced Configuration and System Variables. First, we need to set the ICAP URI. This checks the request for viruses by connecting to the ICAP server. We'll change the default as Trend Micro uses rec-service. The other variable that needs set is the virus header. And again, Trend Micro uses something different, x-virus-id. Next, navigate to Security, Application Security, Integrated Services and Antivirus Protection and enable to ensure that uploads within HTTP requests are inspected. After applying the policy, we'll jump onto the command line and restart the ASM service. Be aware this will affect live traffic. Next, I'll upload a test file just to ensure the service is operational. As we can see from the ASM request log, everything looks good. OK, let's now upload an infected file. Great, the ASM logs have confirmed that the virus was identified by the ICAP server and ASM has duly blocked it. Let's just double check that ICAP server sees the virus as well. That brings us to the end of our demo. Please like, subscribe and as always if you need any more info contact us at the email below. Thanks for watching.